Hello guys, welcome back to Captain AJ. Today we are going to see how to make a volcano animation eruption when a plane is going above it. So this is how it will look when it in the PPT. So, so first of all we open a new presentation. We go to layout, go blank. Let's reduce the click add to add notes. Then we go to insert and insert pictures and pictures from file. All of the pictures will be in the description below. So we insert the volcano. Reduce it to 60%. Reduce the zoom and lower it a little bit <coughs> then we insert another picture that is the grass this will also be in the description below we can go we, we go to picture format remove background so we can delete, remove that we select whole and then select outside so we can line it up here and do this right click and send to back. No, we can just reduce its size like this. We do command C or control C if you're using Windows and command V for Mac and control V for Windows. We we also put it on the side <laughs> now if you do f5 then it will only be the volcano but now you will insert the picture of the aeroplane that is here and we also do remove background Now it's like this. Now if you see this, if you see its its length, its width is 3.6. So we take it here and also do it 3.61. We take it outside of the PPT. Then go to animations. Select the path animation and take draw line. We take it from the middle of the aeroplane and take it here with a little bit of slant. So now you can see the aeroplane is going so fast. First we go to effect options while when you open the animation pane. Reduce this is size. We, we don't want a smooth set and not a smooth end. And then you do start on click. We can do duration 6 seconds. And you can close it. So then you click on home. And you can go back to 100%. And press F5. So the volcano is erupting. And if you press the down arrow or right arrow, the plane will go. This is how you make a volcano uh, eruption animation in uh, in Microsoft PowerPoint. And thanks for watching and bye.